Hey, what's up guys? Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Beyond Reviews. It's me, Blake, your host with the most. <laughs> Just kidding. Anyways, we at Beyond Reviews would like to thank all of you for helping one of our videos reach 61,000 views. And which video is it? It was the Hori Tech Pro um, keyboard and mouse review. Thank you so much for making that an awesome video, 61,000 views. Uh, my team and I couldn't even imagine that we would reach that many views with that video. So thank you for all the support for the viewers and the subscribers. Thank you so much. Also for all the comments for telling us to make an update um, a review about the keyboard and mouse for the Hori Tech Pro. And you guys have been telling me to check it out with the Call of Duty World War II and we're going to be playing that right now. I'm going to show you how I do with the controller and how I do with the Hori Tech Pro. So, um, I just want to remind you guys to the other expert uh, professional players out there. I am just an amateur. I just play this for fun, but I look for tech gadgets that will make gameplay a lot easier. So check this video out. Okay, so before we begin, I would just like to say a good friend of mine sent this over. This is the uh, tactical Assault Commander Horitech um, also, but it, it's the grip controller type G1. He told me it hasn't been working for him. He tried all different kinds of things to try to make it work and it hasn't been working. So Horitech Pro, um, if I do review this one and it doesn't work, I hope that store, wherever my friend bought it, would give him back his money or else you've got a lawsuit, buddy. Just kidding. Anyways, hopefully he can get his money back. If this doesn't work, we'll, we'll be shooting this soon, probably next week. Anyways, um, we have um, updated our, our little game area here. I have a bigger mouse pad now. Take a look at that. And we did uh, purchase this headphones. Um, I went to Data Blitz and I was asking him, hey, you have any um, Bluetooth headphones? And he, they showed me one, I think it was a Razer or something, and it was about 15,000 pesos here in the Philippines, which is about 300 to $400, $300 roughly. And I was like, nah, man, I just want something that's uh, affordable and, you know, wear and tear, very, uh, that you can, that it would be good with wear and tear. And um, they recommended, Data Blitz recommended the HyperX Cloud Stinger, and it's only about 2,195 pesos. Uh, at Data Blitz, and it has been performing very well. A good friend of mine, uh, I recommended it to a good friend of mine. He also purchased it, Joseph Richard Saints, and he was very happy with its performance. I'm very happy with its performance. It's so comfy. Uh, you can flip this up and down, turns the mic on and off. And I've been using this with a Monster Hunter World and PS4. I've been able to play with my brothers and talk to them, Emil and Raymond, on this, so it's fantastic. And uh, well, um, we'd like to apologize also that we haven't created an update video right away because here at Beyond Reviews, we review all kinds of different things. Like for example, the catalyst for the Series 3 iWatch. Um, watch out for that soon. So we review all kinds of things. This is a case for the um, iWatch. And this one is a drone that be, we've been um, sent by different companies to review. This is the Sky Viper. So we're gonna be reviewing this soon. Watch out for those episodes. And for the subscribers and viewers right now, if you wanna check out more of my other videos, we also do vlogs, uh, reviews on food, restaurants here in the Philippines. So check those out. And now let the games begin. I'm gonna start playing with the Call of Duty um, World War II with a controller. I'm gonna show you right now. All right, let's do some sniping. Okay, gotta hold down the R3 button here. Still doing all right. Let's just try to snipe the, the heads while straight the Okay, that's pretty good. Let me change weapon. Okay, I'm gonna shoot this. These targets going up and targets going down. Here we go. Okay, that's pretty good. Reload. Okay, let's get this other target here. Going forward. Now let's snipe it. Come here. One. Cool, cool. And let's shoot the real far one. Here we go. Hold his breath. Boom. And the little red 
there. Okay. Did I get it? Yeah, I did. Yeah, yeah. That's pretty good. Alright, so this was playing with the controller. Now let's change to um, the Hori Tech Pro. So now this is with the mouse and keyboard. Hori Tech Pro 1. Now I'm strafing while I'm holding the L3 button and it's so easy. Switch weapon. I'm gonna go from down. Oh, I missed one. Anyway. There we go. And now moving forward. That's pretty cool. Let me get one here. And let me get the last one there. And that red button. Let me get that red button right there. Yeah. Woohoo! Yeah, I'm pretty happy with this one. Um, well, it's because, like I said from my previous one, I came from uh, the old school Counter-Strike when we used to play with keyboard and mouse. So I give mad props to those guys who can play with the PS4 controller. So for those of you who can't play well with this, I suggest you yeah, just get the HoriTac Pro. It's a lot of fun. Now let's check it out on the uh, online game. Hey, what's up guys? So we had to ditch the multiplayer online game because um, uh, we've been waiting uh, in the lobby itself and nobody was logging on here in Asia, in the Philippines. So we decided to just try it out um, on the campaign mode. So here we are. We have to get to that church. And we're hiding behind this. Let me get Hello. Shoot a couple of bad guys here. Oh, what's that man? Okay. So you do have to use a bit of strategy. You can't just go forward right away. You know, even though they're, they're computer AIs, you have to uh, take your time. Them all. Let me provide some. Oh, what's up? Caught you guys there. Oh, there's somebody up here. Are we clear? Are we clear? Oh, there's some. Oh, hey, hey. I see you. Gotcha. Hide behind this. So my guys are moving forward there. Oh, I see somebody up there. Ooh. My guys are moving forward. Let me get rid of that guy up there. Okay. Let's move forward. Cover hey, what's up, Pearson? Let's move forward, man. Floor. I got him, I got him. Going in. Got your back. Ooh, what's up? Hide behind this cabinet here. What's up? Oh man. Oh. I need I need another weapon. Swapping it. What's up? Okay, I need to heal. Let me kill this guy first. Yeah. Heal, heal. Did I heal? Okay. Reload. Alright. Teams in. Okay, what's up? What's up? Oh, they're coming in here. Whoa! What's up? Surprise! One survived? No. Put to the church! Shit, there's more on the street! Let's get an iron sight here. Come on, man, look at that. Yes. Boom! I wish I had a sniper rifle here. What's up, man? Hey, what's up? Ooh! Take the church, what's up? Oh my goodness, I'm just like rushing in here. Bad move, bad move. What, what was I thinking? Woohoo! Duck. Heal. First aid. Oh ho ho! Let 
Need str smoke grenade. Smoke, out. smoke is good. I'm being so brave again. All right, guys. So I can't really show you the whole um, campaign, but overall, definitely, if you're playing Battlefield One or um, Call of Duty World War Two, and you're used to playing with um, mouse and keyboard, the Horitech Pro is definitely a, will add a big plus to your gaming. Look at that! Oh man, I just love doing that. Come on, man. reload. Hurry up! Boom. 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 Yes. Anyways, thank you for watching. Um, for more reviews from Beyond Reviews, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, like and share. Leave a comment of what would you like us to review next. Definitely, I'm looking at uh, um, the Monster Hunter world, but I don't know if I can use this on that. I've been playing with a controller and I'm very happy with the controller when it comes to that game. And this is Blake. Enjoy your gaming guys. See ya. Ooh. Come here, come here. Man, he's got like he's on a What's up? We gotcha. We gotcha.